This information is brought to you by Syndicuse Health Center and the International Travel Clinic at Western Michigan University. We are pleased to learn that you have decided to participate in a study abroad program. We strongly recommend that every student schedules a pre-departure appointment with us about six to eight weeks prior to travel. These appointments are individualized. You can call to schedule an appointment with a registered nurse at Syndicus Health Center by calling 269-387-3298. You will have to leave a message and we will get back to you within 48 business hours. Before your appointment, we investigate the most up-to-date resources, including Shoreline Travex, the Center for Disease Control, the World Health Organization, the International Society of Travel Medicine, and the Advisory Committee on Immunization Practices. In order to determine the most appropriate services we can offer you prior to leaving for your study abroad. We also give immunization advice. Recommendations are based on medical history, itinerary, and the purpose of travel, including the length of stay. You will receive your immunizations and prescriptions at the time of your appointment. We recommend that you bring all vaccination records with you. We will review all immunization histories with you at the time of your visit. It is recommended that you obtain your immunization record from a primary care doctor, your parents, or the administrative office in the school district in which you graduated high school and bring them with you to your appointment. Depending on where you're going, some of the recommended vaccines include a tetanus booster, measles, mumps, and rubella vaccine, hepatitis A vaccine, hepatitis B vaccine, varicella vaccine, better known as chicken pox, and meningitis vaccine. Typhoid fever is a food and water illness, and a vaccine is recommended for certain countries. Other vaccines that might be recommended for you during your trip would include rabies vaccine, Japanese encephalitis vaccine, influenza, and polio vaccine. Preventative measures while traveling depend on where you visit, how long you will stay, and the amount of risk that exists while you're traveling. We give specific recommendations on food and water precautions in the area, the causes and what medications you can take to help resolve traveler's diarrhea if needed. We provide information on both over-the-counter medications as well as prescription medications. We also review malaria precautions, which is a preventable infection that can be fatal if left untreated. Malaria is spread by a mosquito that carries the malaria infection. Malaria is located throughout the world and there are certain preventative measures that everyone should take, including anti-malaria medications and insect precautions. The nurse will review these in detail with you at your travel appointment. Mm. We will also review yellow fever, which is transmitted similar to malaria. It is also a mosquito-borne illness. This mosquito bites during the day. At your visit, we will review any medications that you may be currently taking. We recommend that you bring medications from home, including antidiarrheal medications, pain medications, and antibiotic ointment. For women, we recommend that you carry your own sanitary products on your trip. And for everyone, having a spare pair of eyeglasses or contacts is also a good idea. You should also bring prescription medications with you.
Bring enough to last the entire trip in their original containers, and if possible, a letter from your doctor which states you're on that medication. If you have serious health issues, you should also consider wearing an alert bracelet or having an ID card that lists these health issues. Finally, the nurse will also advise you on jet lag, sun protection, and general safety measures. We even review how to walk and drive defensively. We recommend you avoid night travel and use caution regarding alcohol use. You can find more information on our website at www.syndicuse.com. Additional information is available on the cdc.gov website as well as www.travel.state.gov and the World Health Organization at www.who.who.int forward slash en. Thank you and I hope this information was helpful. We look forward to seeing you at Cindy Q's Health Center Travel Clinic.